things I, I inspire my students to try and do is have their own voice. I think it's really important to, to be your own artist. Uh, maybe you enjoy playing cover tunes, and that's great, and I do too. Uh, but I think it's really a really fulfilling part of being a musician is to find that voice of your own and to be creative and to be an individual. So these things are called signature licks that kind of define us as guitarists or musicians. And one of mine is, I'll show you. I slide on my notes a lot. I'll be like, I do that, another bass technique. So, so I do that a lot, and that kind of says, that's Mikhail Raris when he's playing. Not only have I played guitar in a lot of bands in the past, I've, I've been on percussion, I've been in the bass seat uh, with some really amazing musicians, so I took all these things and combined them into my current uh, style. Uh, so I play slap pop acoustic guitar when I'm looping a lot of times, and people really think that's pretty cool, and it sounds like this. Uh, it's just a slap pop technique, but applied to acoustic guitar. So if I put it in a loop, I got this... So uh, I've played a lot of different kinds of music uh, through the years, but currently I'm out on the circuit doing this looper thing, acoustic uh, guitar stuff. I just put an album out called Fireside Philosopher. And uh, so I'm out on, the, out on the road and pushing a lot of pedal dancing, pedal buttons, pushing a lot of, on a lot of pedals. <laughs> I always do that. So uh, at any rate, a lot of people ask me, how do, you, how do you make a square loop? And I tell them, you know, make sure you got looper shoes. That's important. You've got to have a flat, stiff sole on there. So we're going to drop a loop.